kill a baby like that. I, I, I can't wrap my head around it. Tragedy in Tulare County. Tonight we're learning more about two of the six people killed in a shooting in Goshen. Family members have identified the young mother as Alyssa Paraz and her baby boy as Nicholas Nolan Paraz. Authorities are searching for at least two suspects in the gruesome killings. The Tulare County Sheriff now describes the massacre as being, quote, like a cartel style execution. Deputies responded to a home on Harvest Avenue near Road 68 around 3.30 this morning. New video tonight shows investigators still on the scene more than 16 hours later, gathering evidence and interviewing survivors and neighbors. Action News South Valley reporter Eliza Navarro spoke with the victim's loved ones who are heartbroken about the tragedy. This is the Goshen property where investigators say at least two shooters went on a rampage early Monday morning, killing six people. The gunfire so intense, it was initially called in as a potential active shooter. There's several structures here. There's trailers, there's a wood structure home, and then a neighboring home, uh, all of which appear to be connected either by family or friends, uh, all of which appeared to be targeted. Among the victims are a teenager and her baby boy. I spoke with the teen's grandfather today. I can't understand who can kill a baby like that. I, I, I can't wrap my head around it. How can somebody be a monster do that? I, I, I can't comprehend it. Family members say the young mother was only 16 years old and her son just 10 months old. They tell me the teen was from Northern California and had been living with her father's side of the family in Goshen for the last year. I believe she's the answer can all day. I still follow. Her aunt posted emotional videos of her niece on social media and released this statement saying, now I will never be able to see her again. She was the happiest girl you could ever meet. She loved her family. She loved her mom. She loved her dad. One neighbor who did not want to be identified says the gunshots woke her up in the middle of the night. She says although she didn't know the victims, she's praying for them and hopes justice is served. Innocent the baby. It broke my heart and hopefully, hopefully they get him. They have to pay for it, whatever they did. Tulare County Sheriff Mike Boudreau says the shooting appears to be tied to gangs and possibly drugs. He went on to describe it as being like a cartel style execution. We do not believe that this is a random act of violence. We believe that this is very targeted. Um, this was very personal. Uh, we also believe that it was a message being sent. Detectives served a narcotics search warrant at this home last week and say shots were fired at the property during a drive by, but believe this morning shooters were much more methodical. In Goshen, Eliza Navarro, ABC 30 Action News. The Tulare County Sheriff's Office is scheduled to hold a news conference at 1 o'clock tomorrow afternoon regarding this developing story. You can watch it live on our ABC 30 News app and we'll bring you the latest developments on future editions of Action News.